Hello everyone, thanks for joining us on the Ghanaian Farmer TV. My name is Zainunam, all the way from Ghana. I'm presently in Morocco to participate in ASTA Cohort 3 2025. After three days of staying in a classroom, we've gone to the field to see an only farm learned a lot. And now we are back to campus, I mean UMCSP campus. And we found ourselves in a lab. I don't know so much about it, I don't know the help or the work they do there but i'm with one of the managers to tell us a bit more about what happens in the lab thank you for joining me what's your name and who are you yeah thank you for your for uh, having me with you in this uh, interview you are most welcome in the uh, penoma platform at uh, um6p my name is kamal hajawi and the research engineer working on plant phenotyping and crop improvements and they serve as well as platform manager in the in the Okay, you are a research engineer? Yes. Okay, so initially we were in the lab over there. Exactly. You were showing us some seeds. Yes. What do you actually do in the lab before yeah. it even comes to where we are now? Yeah, and actually we have, uh, like let's say, a bigger team with the multidisciplinary researchers uh, working from plant breeders with the data scientists. We have uh, phytochemists. We have uh, people working on plant stress resistance and pre-breeding as well. So we have a multidisciplinary uh, research that work uh, to, to, together to, uh, to do experiments at the Phenoma platform where Pheno stands for phenotyping and then Ma stands for uh, country code of Morocco and then means as well uh, water in the Moroccan dialect. So um, why we have named it uh, referring to water because uh, the last seven years in Morocco were really droughty and then uh, we have faced um, severe water. Uh, here in, 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 in Bengria, we, uh, it's already a harsh environment where we receive no more than 100 millimeter per year. So uh, that's why we have uh, created, uh, built this uh, phenotype in a platform, which is um, uh, at the African continent. It's from the really few phenotype platform where we can do uh, high level research in the agricultural sector. So we have uh, many components in the platform. We have grow chambers right. uh, where we uh, control all the weather conditions uh, and they are there uh, uh, ready for UM6P and ecosystem researchers to do their experiments throughout the year. And we have as well uh, a, a room called Fenomerzuga. These are uh, enclosed chambers where we control again weather conditions, but the machines are coupled with um, a small lysimetric system. It's a balance that will weight the pot and then a calculation will be made to irrigate automatically, compensating whatever water was lost by uh, transpiration. So we can work in, uh, on a drought in the atmosphere, what is called uh, VPD. And we can uh, separate it from a drought in the soil. Okay. Yeah. So we can work on the different uh, stresses, these two stresses, or either com uh, even combine it with another biotic stress, like let's say the parasitic uh, weeds or uh, diseases or pathogens. Yeah. So we we, ha we have uh, like let's say a small germplasm mm -hmm. of uh, different kind of uh, crops. We have uh, uh, cereals like a uh, small germplasm of uh, bread wheat, durum wheat, barley. Okay. And then we have legumes as well. Right. Uh, we have lentils, chickpea, uh, faba bean, rice bean. And we have also some uh, really uh, African uh, crops like mm -hmm. pearl millet mm -hmm. and then uh, cowpea okay. uh, as well. So we do, uh, we do have uh, collaboration with many uh, institutions mm -hmm. throughout the African continent or worldwide. Okay. We work with the uh, Ghanaian uh, collaborators, uh, APBA, right. and the uh, uh, Ghana University. Mm. The Ghana University of Ghana. Uh, University of Ghana, right. exactly, with the Prof. Uh, Eric Dankwa yes. and his team. We do a collaboration to make, uh, uh, let's say, a network of uh, plant breeders at the African level. Right. Try to network in and then uh, uh, invest in the young. Uh, young future leaders right. in the uh, agriculture uh, sector. Okay, yeah. so is it from the growth place, growth lab and the other lab, then you end up here, right? So exactly, yeah. Okay. It's, a, it's a workflow right. from seed to outdoor system. Right. Beyond here, do you give these seeds to farmers, real farmers, to actually grow on the field? Um, actually, what we do is we work uh, in a close relationship with the, the Moroccan institution called INRA. Right. It is the National Research Institute working on agriculture. Yes. So this uh, national system, uh, they have, uh, let's say, uh, field uh, 
experimental stations throughout Morocco, in all the agroecological places in Morocco. So we uh, give them seeds, let's say the good uh, selected germplasm. They will test it in different uh, stations and then uh, they organize uh, farmer uh, days where they, uh, they invite uh, farmers uh, to, go, to come and see those varieties, those good genotypes that may uh, go to the farmer the feed by, 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 by the way. So we work, we work in this, hand uh, in this hand. Yeah, yes, hand in hand. Yeah. Okay. But we, like let's say, we don't have, like, it's, it's, um, uh, our work stops in the, let's say, variety registration. Right. Uh, from variety registration to technology transfer to farmers, it's uh, to uh, INRA and uh, ONCA, another okay. uh, Institution. institutions that, yeah. That, now yes. get to the farmers. Exactly. We okay, want to, no, uh, no right from your lab to the farmers. Yeah, yes, yeah. Okay. Yeah, yeah. okay. Because, because, you know, mm -hmm. uh, farmer, you, you need to know you need to have an, an, a network you need to speak the language of the mm, farmer mm, mm. so it's a uh, it's uh, it's the feed of another people to, mm. to reach the to reach the farmer but yes our uh, let's say varieties will reach yes we actually we are actually working for the smallholder farmers, farmers. yes yeah okay. in morocco and the, and the broad as well right yeah. okay so that's it a lot of science technologies okay yeah, yeah. but i'm excited that he knows professor dankwa who is doing an like, excellent work back home in exactly. ghana and this is just you know a bit of uh, insight into what happens here in case you are hoping or working or planning to come to morocco don't forget to visit them and see the amazing work they are doing but i'm happy that it's an african thing it's not just for morocco but for ghana and other parts of the african countries will be a full beneficiary stay tuned for more to come in morocco my name is anyanam and this is the ghanian for my remember to subscribe to my channel i'll see you on the flip side thank you very thank much thank you very much thank you hey. You're